What is happening, guys? <sighs> guys, I might take a few times. Hope you're all keeping well. Hope you're keeping sound wherever you are in the world or whatever time it is. Hope you're having a good morning, evening, afternoon. So, I'm dropping this video just to be honest with you guys, just in general. I've had to do a lot of hard thinking, um, decision making, self reflecting, soul searching, and as you can tell by the title of this video, it is a decision that I have locked down on, and yeah, my YouTube days are now over. It's a decision I haven't exactly had to take lightly. It's a decision I don't particularly want to be making, but it's a decision I feel like I had to be real with myself and I feel like I had to accept that it's not something for me to do anymore. I first created this channel eight years ago and the memories that I've made throughout that time have been absolutely incredible. I've got to experience things I never thought I'd do. I got to meet people that I never thought I'd ever meet. Met plenty of great people, but also I've met some not so great people at the same time. There is multiple elements to why I will no longer be uploading on this channel at all. Um, I think one of the biggest factors right now is lack of inspiration, lack of passion that I have for making content. 2019 and 2020, those were the years where my spark was at its peak. So I just I just loved making content. I loved making things that not only I'd enjoy, but I know that other people enjoy at the same time. But as of the past year and a bit, that that spark has just completely evaporated, diminished or extinguished or whatever word you want to use basically that that spark I had is it, it it's gone. It sucks to even say it because like for many years I've just loved it. Like even when people used to ridicule me and ridicule for just me being myself making videos but I did it because I enjoyed it and I wasn't gonna, you know, like follow a crowd or just follow what people thought in society because I just I just wanted to be me. I just wanted to be myself and do what I love doing and just do my own thing. And for a while YouTube was my escape and like even before making content YouTube was my escape. From my school years, college years, that was always one of my biggest forms of escapes. It really was. The platform was just getting way, way, way more ruthless and people were just beefing with one another for no reason. And now as of recently people just want to dox people's information and that also unfortunately happened to me this year and it put me in a mental state where I didn't feel safe. I felt paranoid. I just became so worried about my own, you know, well-being and I thought, what if something happens? And I shouldn't have to feel like that. Hobbies are meant to be enjoyed, not stressed and worried about. So yeah, that's one of the few reasons. I want to be able to look out for my own well-being and I feel like with the ideas that I had in mind for content, I don't think people would have particularly enjoyed it. Even when I made Progress, which is the documentary that I did, which to this day I'm really still proud of making and I'm happy to have put as much money into it as I did because I wanted to do something positive. But then I came up with more ideas which would have, would have cost around the same amount of money that it would for Progress and it wasn't really going to make any form of benefit if I put out that type of content that would have cost a lot but not gained a lot so it was just like there's no point in me going ahead with it. I'm just at a point where I feel like I just don't feel like there's a place for me on this platform anymore. The decision of me leaving the platform completely I don't, I don't think it's really going to be a big loss to anybody anyways but all I say is I'm still thankful for all the memories that I've made with some great people, even those who I no longer speak to. Um, if you one of those people who I used to make content with and I don't speak to you nowadays, I just want to let you know I'm still appreciative of the memories that i made. And I just want to say thank you to every single person who has been involved in my journey, whether you were there from the beginning or any other 
part or like I said if you if I no longer speak to you or if I do still speak to you I just want to say thank you to every single one of those people who tuned in in the first place. Some people may not have seen my older content but as much as I cringe at my old content I'm not going to take any video down more of my videos will still remain up so if if anyone is even remotely interested whatsoever, if you want to look back on my channel and just look at some of my oldest stuff, even my first ever vlog, which I refuse to watch again because I cringe at it so much. If you if you want to watch that, that's available to watch anytime. Even my old little series of B trends that I did back in like 2017, 2018. If you want to watch that, I've uh, unprivatized the videos as well, so you can always watch that anytime. Um, even some well-known videos like the uh, prank I did on KSI, stuff like that. If you ever want to watch it, always available. Will I ever upload again? I don't know. I really don't know. All I know is there's, there's just not really a place for me on here anymore. And I just, I feel like it's now time for me to close a chapter in my life and, you know, start a new one. Hey, thank you for the memories really and just if you've been a part of the journey and if you've enjoyed the content if i've inspired anybody at all i just want to say i'm glad to have helped in any way shape or form to be able to help you escape whatever struggles you're going through in your life or anything at all i'm glad to be able to be that person to help you just get away from whatever you struggled with with me leaving the platform, I feel like there'll be someone a little bit way more deserving who can inspire people a lot better will be able to use their platform to help a lot more people. So if you're one of those people who do that, keep inspiring and just keep doing what you do. Thanks for everything really and maybe one day I might see you again. Uh, if not, then it's been a pleasure. And stay safe as always as i always say so yeah that's that really